Hello everyone and welcome to the Star Wars Vault. If you are new to the channel, please make sure to subscribe to see new Star Wars videos every week. How's it going fellas? Today I want to point out something I found out about Count Dooku in the visual dictionary I own from Episode 2 in the original Star Wars Saga. This paragraph I found talks about how big of a deal it was for Count Dooku to leave the Jedi Order and how it was a big deal really for any Jedi to leave since it was such a rarity. The title of this paragraph is The Lost Twenty, and it reads, Only twenty individuals in the history of the Jedi Order have ever renounced their commissions. Their leave-taking is sorely felt among the Jedi, who memorialize them with portrait bust in the archives. Count Dooku is the most recent of the lost ones. He is considered the most bitter loss because the Force was so strong in him. And I thought this was an important detail since it seemed to really highlight how huge of a loss Dooku was for the Jedi Order, but I think this makes plenty of sense. He was the direct Padawan of Grandmaster Yoda, which shows how important he truly meant to the Order as a whole, because he learned from the very best. He became a Jedi Master of such high regards, even passing on his teachings to Qui-Gon Jinn, who also went on to become a Jedi Master. I do appreciate the mention of the bus created for the Lost 20, as there is continuity from the movie itself to back this up, when we see a deleted scene of Obi-Wan observing Dooku's bus in the archives and asking the Jedi librarian Jocasta Nu why the Jedi Master left the Order. A very cool scene if you haven't already come across it. And I'd say the biggest takeaway from this paragraph for me is how it notes that Dooku was the most bitter loss because the Force was so strong with him. This is also well known as he sh has shown his abilities in his duels with Obi-Wan, Anakin, and Yoda during the movies, but something you may not have known is that the Count was always blessed with his abilities in the Force. He had a high potential early on, having a high midichlorian count that was greater than most, nearly almost about 14,000. Match that potential in the Force with the elite amount of experience and mentorship he received, Dooku was without a doubt one of the most powerful Jedi the Order had ever seen, and thus it was a pity that he relinqu relinquished his duties with the Order and eventually became a Sith. So now I want to know what you guys think about all this. Do you think it was a pivotal moment for Count Dooku to leave the Jedi Order? Are there any other Jedi that you think would have been a greater loss than him perhaps? Make sure to post your opinions down in the comments. If you enjoyed the video today, please hit the like button to support the channel. I appreciate it a lot. My social media can be found in the description below. That will be it. Thank you all so much for watching. And until next time, my friends, may the force be with you.